All right, YouTube, so today I have a pretty interesting, pretty good deck if you can get the combo off. And it is using a lot of new cards, right? So we've got Sunborn Summoning. This is the new card, so it lets you tutor your uh, champions, which is very crucial for this deck. Uh, you really, there's only one Lysandra, hopefully you don't draw her, but only after the combo you need Lysandra just to guarantee a win with the Watcher. But all the other uh, champions, you're just going to want to draw them for Talia setting up the combo. Sivir, uh, you want to either draw her or mulligan her for um, just like staying in the game, right? She's just really good removal, really good pressure. So she keeps you in the game early. So that's one. That's the first champion you need to make this deck work. All right. So this is a very complicated, convoluted, like way of playing the game. Like this whole entire deck is just like a whole way of life. So every section or every champion. So you have three champions, and each one of them is needed for different time like time areas in the gameplay right lissandra late game um sivir early game and then talia like mid game right and they're all and every other card revolves around that so it's gonna be kind of rough to like you know if you're if you don't know how to really uh you know pilot the deck it's gonna be kind of rough but the basic basic goal is um after Sivir keeps you alive and you have lots of Merciless Hunters, um, Bone Crushers, just really good for trading, uh, Avalanches if you're going against aggro, um, you also have a couple Bellow Breasts again for the aggro, you've got the Bakai uh, Wither claw, uh, claw for more removal, right? It plays and it grants uh, Vulnerable, plus it gives them minus two every time you swing as long as this guy stays on the board. Uh, which is pretty easy because he has four health and you know, it's a very important number um, Tons of uh, Negations and denies you also have the avenging Vestia for deny You got a couple Acquisitioners for the control the Explorer spells um, And then here's the combo uh, after I explain like kind of like the pacing and like how you're alive like all the other cards are just to like keep you alive right this is what wins you the game right here it's going to be the these cards the new cards spearnir thunder song and also the reconstructor right and you're going to be targeting uh with the thunder caller thunder song guy you're, you're gonna want to um always target clock hand so this is a clock hand uh copy deck and as soon as you get one um, clock hand uh, turned into a landmark, right? So here's the combo. This gets turned into a landmark, all right? I I'm trying to like read the names for all these, f all these like new cards, complicated name cards. Like I'm kind of like stumbling over my words. This is how it works. You turn this card, this eight mana card into a landmark and his ability grants you a landmark uh, advancement tool right so if you can just keep copying this guy and keep turning him into landmarks you can create like an infinite combo with him or a better target um 
you could use this too, the uh, Black and Ice Dragon, right? Which creates you two uh, thralls. Which, if you already get the combo off, these summon immediately because you have a whole entire hand of instant countdown uh, cards generated by this guy, right? So, as soon as you get him into a landmark at any point in time, you could use um, this card, the Reconstructor card, to um, make the landmark like revive itself right and i don't know what's up with the timing of this card but if this is like an eight mana card or eight countdown card even if well it doesn't matter because you're going to get the um the discount anyways but for whatever reason this revives at one i don't know if it's like a bug or what but it always goes a lot of times it goes back to one sometimes i think it's gone to eight but I, I don't know how this card works. I think it's just bugged. I don't know if this works or not. Um, I've seen it work where sometimes it revives at one count, and then I've also had it where it's only been at, at eight. So I don't I don't understand that. But it doesn't really matter because you're gonna get infinite discounts anyways, and everything's gonna get popped immediately. So kind of a convoluted, super long combo. But the best case scenario on turn three. You draw one of these and you put it on a clock hand and then you just dump everything else you dump one of these on the on the landmark and then on turn eight it pops um and then you you also have one of these the sandstorm thing to generate more discounts for it right so maybe on turn like i don't know man six sometimes sometimes usually on eight right but whenever right whenever it pops you're gonna have infinite eight mana cards infinite eight mana drops that just always spawn sp you know respawn on your board over and over again and you just recreate them over and over again till again creates more of them um and yeah that's basically it I, I i didn't do a huge amazing job explaining it but let me get it on video enjoy the Alright, so unless he gets um, the Elder Dragon online, we should win because we're going to have infinite 8 eights. So we should be okay. Let's try to get our combo. The Merciless Hunters aren't going to be great for removal, and we're not playing against aggro, so that's not helpful. Okay, so we got one part of the combo. Um, alright, we got Talia to, uh, gain more value. Alessandra Talia Siver. Yep, you, you can't Google that one, bud. We could actually copy Talia's too. We'll try that since we do have two Talia's. That might be cute. Talia's might be fun. We'll try it with Talia. Oh, actually, that was a terrible idea. I don't have a lot of uh, landmarks. Oh, actually, I could fill the board with them. It's okay. I have the combo. I think maybe this card works when you target it. It goes back to when you target it on what um what it is. I think cuz it seems very inconsistent. It seems like it comes up a random number or a different number every time. Dude, why is this guy roping me? Passed? Oh, I should have attacked. Oh, is that why he's confused? Well, 
let's block it down. Do I want to just do this later? Nah. Dragons or something in a dragon deck? What is going on? Um, do we just want to swing? Not really, right? So we should have five Talias, right? Two, four, five. Basically just means we need this off the board eventually. Remember uh, Teen Titans? There was a uh, character like this, right? Anybody remember that from the fucking 2000s? It was a Beast Boy and Terra. Remember that shit? Relax your knees. Yo, what is that supposed to mean? Relax your knees. That was all my Talia's though, so. <sighs> Holy shit, dude. What is this guy doing? You're killing me.
Bruh. Cool looking card. Should have five. Right. Yeah, see, it goes to one. You see that? It always goes back to one. It's crazy, right? We're doing this just to upgrade Talia. Together, we are stronger than stone, faster than the wind. And now we swing with uh, a bunch. We have four Talias to swing with. Hopefully, that does something. He's not gonna be able to uh, put anything on the stack too as Another soon as we open. Day guarding the walls. Now I take to the sky. I found a home among the Dragon Guard. We are your people, Anna, and you ours. Huh? Wait, what? Where's my Talia's? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Where's my Talia's? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. 
Wait a minute, where are my Talia's? Oh no. Beware falling rocks. Some rocks just won't sit still. Oh no. It doesn't work. It it worked before. It worked on the A cost. What the fuck? This is just bugged. I think this is just broken. Sometimes it works. Sometimes if it goes down to one cost, it doesn't have anything inside of it. Sometimes sometimes it summons like six of the- I don't know. Man. The game's broken. This doesn't make any sense. This is ridiculous. Um, okay, I mean, deny, I guess. <sighs> what a horrible, unfortunate bug. I don't know, sometimes it bugs in your favor and sometimes it doesn't. It bugs in a horrible way. I don't know, it's all bad. Well, at least he's down to two cards. I guess that's not bad. Feels bad. I mean, we won still, even though we still we got bugged and everything. Whatever. Oh wow, here he is. Congrats! Thanks for showing up, idiot. Wins a win, I guess. Dude, I got gypped out of I got gypped out of two extra Talias, man. Why? Why? What happened? Okay, so we got the Thunder Song. Uh, Lysandra, not right now. Talia, actually Talia, maybe later. I need to get an ACOS unit to put in here. Okay. Alright, so we got the server for a little early game.
Why would he? Why would he open, dude? Whatever. Come no closer. That sucks. Oh, I have the clockwork. Gonna get some backup out here. Ooh, that's a crazy, that's a crazy combo. So he could get the the copy next turn. Wow, that's actually genius. It's a quick attack. Forgot about that. Damn, do I just want to just block with the Leans? Call it a call it a day. cards because I think the copy card is bugged. It doesn't work. Sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. It's like really weird. Perfect, but so he has to start over again. Sorry, right, helps out Boss. a lot.
Oh wait, it goes. Uh, it was already at five. Invitation only. I guess to leave this, we need more units, right? We don't really have a choice. I will leave my own path. My journey won't end until I'm through weaving it. We should be okay. Um, yikes, I should have replaced this too. But. Yikes. Yeah, <laughs> that's pretty bad. It's not good. Consider really help that much? I mean, better than Lysandra. Great 
timing. Wait, if I silence this, does this die? No slowing down. Easy for you to say. So close to leveling, we're one off. Oh, actually, we could do this. Maybe. Dump these and just be trying. My strength is that of the mountain. Jesus. 